All right, so it's a uh, rainy and pretty nasty day. So I figured today would be a good time to get the motor connected to the uh, adapter plate and the flywheel and the clutch because you have to do that before you put it into the car. Uh, so the first step with that, let me just grab the parts. Are these these two bits here? So this is a spacer that fits right on here, as you can see, right like that, and it pushes the coupler up just enough so that it, it works with this uh, output shaft properly. And this is a key for this key shaft. As you can see, the key, uh, this motor has a key shaft, meaning that there is a call it a, a key running down the side. So this fits right in there. And that keeps the, the coupler in place. So first I'm just going to install the really just drop on the spacer which is just like that and I'm done. And then this uh, just hammers in. Really simple like that. And that's it. So the rest of this is probably going to be a time lapse as we've got a lot of stuff to bolt in and add and it, it'll be a pretty long video if it wasn't. So you probably noticed that looks a little different than uh, what it was just like before. Uh, and what happened is that I decided a little later to torque down the bolts some more, even though I'd already put Loctite on them. No, no, that was stupid. And one of them ended up snapping off, as you can see. And what I've been doing is uh, welding nuts to it, welding a nut to it, and then uh, taking out the, the part of the bolt that's still in there. So yeah, this, this is the welding setup for now. Uh, yeah, so let's get into that.
tried to weld on a new nut, but I wasn't talented enough to do it, so I ended up taking it to a machine shop. Um, and they welded on a nut and were able to get it out. So uh, this is take two for the adapter plate. I went over the adapter plate with uh, just some black oil paint. Um, I think it'll go better with the white, uh, the white and black on the on the car. <clears throat> I only painted the part that would be visible once it's installed. It's like this is all going to be on the motor housing and then the inside I didn't bother with, except for a little test spot uh, because that'll be all inside the uh, bell housing. I had it.